Hey guys, welcome back to Jax Legos, and today I will be showing you the Lego Star Wars ATAP Walker. This set is suggested for ages 9 and up. The Lego ID number is 75234. It has 689 pieces, and the minifigures are Chewbacca, one Kashyyyk Clone Trooper, Clone Commander Gree, and two Kashyyyk Battle Droids. So on the box, as you can see, the uh, Kashyyyk Clone Trooper and Chewbacca are both fighting against the droids, including the ATAP Walker. So, let's start with the minifigures. We have the Kashyyyk Clone Trooper. He's got a super cool helmet and a blaster with him. They're all uh, camo, so the droids can't see him. Let's move on to Jabaka. He's got a crossbow laser gun. He's got some ammo straps around him. And of course, you take his head off and it's nothing because this is his head. So, battle droids are nothing much. They do have green on them in some parts. But basically a you know, regular battle droid. Now, you're probably wondering where Clone Commander Gree is. Well, he's exactly where he's supposed to be. In the ATAP Walker. So, Clone Commander Gree has a silver and green helmet. Excuse my dogs, they are barking at something. But, he has also a blaster. He has the regular clone head. He's also got a camo vest and camo pants, so the droids can't see him. And the silver helmet is to identify that he is a clone commander, not just a trooper. So let's push these aside, and let's get right to the Lego set. The Lego set has one main blaster, including another one on top, which has a spring-loaded blaster on it. So that's really cool. So the top one, you cannot move side to side unless you pull this clip down. I had a lot of trouble at first what realizing what in the world this thing was until you clip it in between the two hooks right there. And once you pull it out, you can twist it 360 degrees. And this also goes slightly up and down. So, if you wanted to, to access the cockpit, cockpit, you would open the whole entire uh, blaster top and you could access the cockpit. Oops, there you go. On the sides, we have little trap doors so the clones can get in and out. We have three legs, but one of them is special. If you bend this back all the way, let me just move my hand here real quick. And there is this little piece right here, as you can see that. And you're gonna put it in the middle. Yeah, yep, there you go. So that is there. Oh man, I keep breaking stuff today. This is just my unlucky day, I guess. But uh, you're gonna clip it in into the center there, because there is a space that you can put it in. And now you just have a two-legged walker. I personally like it three-legged, but any, do whatever. So there's also a small cannon right here in the front. You can move it up and down, side to side, anyway. And uh, yeah, I'm just gonna bring this back down. Cause I told you, man, I broke it again. Ay, ay, ay. And the legs are usually straight, so slightly bent. Whatever. So this is the Lego Star Wars AT AP Walker. And uh, for extra information, this is also from uh, not Lego, but Star Wars: Revenge of the Sith, as known as Episode Three of Star Wars. So there is a huge battle, and this comes in and blasts a ton of droids. On the back, 
of the box, we have how to operate it and how to shoot it. And it shows the two clones in their cockpit and the droids being demolished. That was the Lego Star Wars AT-AP Walker. Thanks for watching and make sure you like, subscribe, and comment. And see you on my next video. I'm out.